What's up, YouTube? Dave here with KickFam, coming at you with another video, and uh, this is a this is a pickup that we had from this past weekend while we were out Christmas shopping for the for the family. Um, and this actually this pickup is actually a, a shout out to Richie Ruckus, one of the guys from that I grew up with that actually has another channel. Go check him out. His uh, YouTube channel is really good. Isn't it good? He's actually growing. And he's one of my, uh, he's actually one of my inspirations on why I do this channel. Um, I've, I've, I've been a sneakerhead for a long time. And I was watching YouTube videos and I was always, always shy to do them. And then I saw him doing them. And then my daughter, Mia, who you met in the last video, saw him doing them. And she's been watching YouTube videos since she's been really little. And she's always been wanting to do YouTube videos. And I just really never got into them. And then when I saw him doing them and her wanting to do them, it kind of it kind of pushed me into doing it. Which, which in reality, it's been fun. It's been it's it's really been bringing me and the family closer. We've been doing a lot more things together because we go out taping. Um, we have a lot more fun. We all, all five of us in the family have sneakers in common, so that helps as well. And, uh, so, like I said, this pickup was actually brought on from watching a video that Richie Ruckus put up a few days ago. I saw this shoe come out on, uh, Instagram and hype beast and kicks on fire and i wasn't too sure of it but then when i saw him wear them and i saw him do the video of them it kind of piqued my interest a little bit more and then i went in on the, i went to the store on saturday and i saw him in one store and i was like kind of like drawn to him but i didn't i, I didn't pull the trigger in that store because I pulled the trigger on another shoe, which will be a video that we that I uh, that I release in a couple days down the line. I'm actually putting something really good together for that video, so I didn't pull the trigger in that store. Then I went to Kicks USA here in my neighborhood, where I usually buy all my sneakers, and I saw it in there again, and it just I, something about the shoe really drew me in and it's weird because I'm not I, I'm not I don't really buy a lot of sneaks from this brand so maybe this model will change my opinion on this brand and you'll I guess I should show you what it is it's actually you can see it's the Adidas blue box you got the original Adidas original symbol and it's actually the pro, the Adidas Pro Fear, um, the one that just came out on Friday. And and like I said, I was I'm never I I haven't been a huge fan of Adidas. I I I maybe own three pairs of Adidas. And like I said in in, in on my Instagram, maybe I'm the only one that doesn't find Boost incredibly incredibly comfortable where I have to go buy them where everybody else's boost is life boost is life I'm not really the type of person that feels boost is life I'm more of a Nike guy I'm a Nike guy through and through it I am a Nike guy through and through and I that's what I was brought up on so and, and if you follow me on Instagram, which is at kickfam underscore amped, A-M-P-P-D underscore apparel, you'll see most of the kicks that I wear and sneakers that I wear and that my family wear are Nike and Jordan brand. So maybe this shoe, maybe this turns me. I mean, this is the first model for the Pro Fear, uh, Pro Fear and maybe it's going to turn me maybe i'll start buying more adidas because of this model maybe maybe just this model will be the sneak maybe just this model will bring me over more i mean i do own 
a tubular shadow, and I wear them. I think they're really comfortable. I I I have an N an N an MND, and that that's comfortable as well. But the NMDs, they're not made for the cold weather. They're they're sock material. Your feet freezes like crazy in them. So I can't wait to see if your feet get cold in this shoe because. This is kind of a sock material, but it's not a sock material. It's actually thicker material. So, I mean, you all have seen it, so it's not like it's some incredible unboxing. But there it is. Like I said, I just think that this sneaker is done incredibly well. Let me pull the other one out, too. The sneakers are just, it's done incredibly well. You got, you got the, you just got the three stripes that Adidas is famous for. You got a huge thick midsole which which is which I think might have drew me to it. I, I don't I guess this big midsole drew me to it. And then the multicolor, the infrared, the infrared there, and then the infrared spots throughout the sneaker. I, I mean they're just clean man. They're, they're a clean sneaker. I mean you got the bottoms <sighs> It's just a clean sneaker. I, I, there's not much I can say on them. And, and I, like I said, maybe this is the model that gets me into buying more Adidas in the, in the near future. Um, I saw a sneaker coming out that looks just like this. It's going to be a collab with Undefeated. It's a tiger. It's a tiger. Uh, ta I think it's the tiger camouflage which is incredible looking that, that would love to get my hands on them when they come out but like i said the only issue with this sneak like richie ruckus said in his video is it's incredibly hard to get on i, I they have a pull tab on the tongue but no pull tab back here and uh so it's incredibly hard to get on i it might get better with a few wears but i mean this sneak is incredible it drew, like I said, I am not an Adidas guy. I, I am a Nikes guy through and through. I've been a Nike guy I, from a little kid all the way till to my age. I'm in my 30s, so my kids are growing up on Nikes. So, like I said, I am a Nike guy through and through. But this might be the sneak that brings me over to Adidas a little bit more. Maybe throw a little bit more Adidas into my rotation. Uh, like I said, I own these now. I own a pair of Tubla Shadows and one pair of NMDs, and the rest of my collection is Nike. So, these are these are a great sneaker. Um, I'm actually glad I got my hands on them. I thought when I saw the when I saw the sneak on uh, Richie's channel, I thought it was going to sell out, and it didn't. It did, and I guess it, I guess it kind of. I guess that along with the other sneaks that came out this week got overshadowed by Yeezy's Adidas. But I think that if these came out alone without a release by Yeezy, I think these might have been harder to get. And that's just that's just my own opinion. I, I may be wrong, but I just it's just an it's just a it's a good ass it's a good sneak. It's a really good sneak, and I'll give it up to Adidas. You really you really hit this one out at a park. Um, you, you might actually have a new customer in the kick fan. Um, definitely with this model. Uh, this is definitely a model that I'll buy in multiple color colorways. Um, because I can see that the, the way that they could do this sneak is it's endless. They can do this sneak in so many different colorways and so many different collabs. So And like I said, the material is just tough. So I don't think that I think this is going to be a good winter sneak as long as you're not slushing around in five inches of snow. I, I mean, in December alone here in Philly, we already had close to eight inches of snow. So, which is odd, very odd for this for this time of year. Um, I haven't worn them yet. Just bought them on Saturday. I, I'm going to definitely be wearing them in the next couple of days. Um, so I'll let you know how they are on feet. Um, you know what? Let me know in the comments if you want me to do an on-foot review of them. Let you know. Um, when I first got them out of the box, I thought they were kind of heavy. But now that I've now that they've been in my hands a few times, they're not as heavy as I thought. 
Um, so, like I said, hit up in the comments. Let me know if you want an in-depth, in, on-foot review. Um, I, I, I'm not really the type of channel that's going to do many on-feet review. Um, this is more of a family. Here's my sneaks. Look what we type of thing. Maybe some style here and there. Um, but an on foot review is it's not our style. We're here to have fun. We're here to show you sneaks. We're here to show you the, the, the sneaks that just came out, the sneaks that we just bought. So, but let me know. I, I'm more than open to do whatever my subscribers want. And remember, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button below. If you dig this, if you dig this video, hit that thumbs up. Um, leave comments below. Let me know how you feel about my channel. Like I said, we're an up-and-coming YouTube channel. Uh, there's going to be more videos coming up. Um, one of my cameras just flatlined on me, so I had to send that back um, to get to get looked at. Hopefully, get a new one back here in a couple days. So. I'll have another video coming out on a, on another bot on another um purchase that we just had this weekend. So remember, before you wear them, you gotta hit them once over with the rejuvenator to make sure they're protected. So let me know if you want that in depth in in depth uh, on foot review, and uh, I'll let you know how they feel. Leave comments below. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up if you dig if you dug this video. Until the next time, this is Dave with Kick Fam. I'll catch you on the next video. <laughs>